Hi everyone, welcome to Gigi's Graphic Studio. Today on our second tutorial for the Halloween car series, I'm going to show you how you can create this mummy shaker cards. So let's get started with the supplies list. I'm going to use foam sheet black and if you want you can use uh, dimensional foam tape but I, I like work with this because I can cut uh, different pieces so also I'm going to cut some strips and square pieces and you need the cardstock black and white pattern paper with this cut six circles and six strips And also we need the mini small punches for using a, a small piece of black cardstock. Uh, three colors of sequins, black, wine, and orange, embossing powder, watermark that, vintage photo ink, a cobweb uh, clear stamp, a small stars clear stamps, black marker or pencil, glue multipurpose or also you can use the glossy accents, scissors, ruler, six acetate circles, sponge dotter, six wooden stamps, permanent ink black, a small brush, Two sentiments clear stamps for the inside and outside of your cards, and six cards in measures five by five. Now I'm going to start create my from window panel, and I previously cut six pieces in black cardstock, and measures four by three and a quarter. And I'm going to start mark my circle with my pencil, and I'm going to use any uh, plastic container that I have on hand, and I'm going to mark a. Uh, cross on the center of my circle and I'm going to start cut uh, in four sections so this little trick is uh, help you a lot because if you don't have a professional tools for cut your circles I mean it's, it's not easy cut circles so this uh, trick is it works good so I really really recommend you so if you try it please leave me a comment below the video Okay, now for my next step, I'm going to take my acetate circle and I'm going to stamp my uh, sentiment. This time I take uh, one from Hampton Art and it's Beware sentiment. So this circle is going to the back of my window panel and I'm going to take any a small uh, acrylic block and add my clear stamp with a watermark uh, and stamp. Uh, to the acetate and add the fine embossing powder and just uh, heat set up with your heat tool and try to clean up with your small brush the excess of the powder and I'm going to do the same thing with the rest of my circles okay now for my next steps I'm going to speed up the video and leave some music so having fun
Okay, with this last step, we're done with the tutorial. So I hope you guys like the video. So if you want to receive uh, tutorials like this, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. And see you here for the next time. Bye!